What's happening, everybody? I'm Grillmaster. Welcome back to more Hygieneer. And this may not be the longest of videos, but we are here. You can hardly see. I'm going to go grab my light so we can actually walk around with it. Uh, this is that one place that I never actually went to before. I have dug up a crap ton. You can see my truck up there. This, uh, this, The truck here is a true nightmare. The reason it works so well at the other place is because I already had a setup. So it took me a lot less time to do that. Trying to get it down here alone took me an hour. So I was like, you know what? I'm not even going to bother with this. Uh, I have no real easy way to refill it. I could build a whole pipe system, but with everything being wiped out, I didn't really want to. So I came down here and I mined it all out over about four hours. <laughs> I just sat there listening to music, helping my kid with her homework, and mining this thing out. <laughs> and I'm like, all right, I'm going to find a treasure down here. And then I got a comment saying that the treasures are not random. So apparently, I don't have to... You know what? We have this lovely unstuck button. There we go. Over there, you can see it is stuck. That's actually a second one. I bought a brand new one just for this place. I have one already at the other place underground. Uh -huh. So, there's that. But yeah, so, come down here. Uh, we're going to go back to the first area. You can see I have my cross on the back from the last treasure we found. I'm going to go over and... Go to the first place where I went and spent two minutes digging in. Yeah, things are not random. The treasures are not random, so we actually have all four treasures. I just haven't put them in yet. We're going to find out what happens when you put all four treasures in. I'm excited. I, I, I'm i kind of sad that I didn't find anything at the other one. I would have liked to, because then I would have at least felt like I had spent my time wisely instead of like four hours of nothingness. <laughs> it was pretty brutal. I was like, are you serious? So come down here and somebody's like, just a little bit further back. And I was like, okay, I'll come back a little bit further. And I mined over to, where was it? Oh no, don't tell me it fell through the flipping world because it was there. Oh god, now it's like somewhere in the ground. It was like, it was like right up here, so it means it's down here in the frickin' bedrock. Because it fell through, I bet, because it was floating. No! Oh, it's right here. Oh my god, it must have been right there. Or something. I'm like digging all around. I literally just dug up this whole section back here trying to find it. But yeah, there's a broken sword in here. Okay, so we have the other two artifacts I just sat there and dug up for like, I don't know, 10 minutes. <laughs> uh, let me out of here. I guess I can just go this way and just climb on top of all my stuff. Anyway, that, that, it doesn't matter. Just let me out. Take all these things over to the cave. We can actually see what we have. That's not what I want to do because then I'm going to start floating you there we go okay i mean i could walk them but meh cave's not very far let's go right here real quick drop off our artifacts okay ye secrets okay take you uh put this one on here i think it's gonna open up that i just happened to notice this time coming in that it actually does look a little different right there What's gonna happen? What's gonna happen? Come on! I wanna move faster! I'm like holding shift to sprint. Sounds. Secrets have opened. What's inside? Find out next time. No, that would be messed up. What do we get? What is this? A treasure chest. What's in the treasure chest? I'm gonna take it outside. Is it just a crap ton of money? It's a treasure chest. Treasure chest. Do I sell treasure chest? I honestly have no idea. Do, do, do. We're just going to go up here and sell it, I guess. I mean, I could, I'm going to use it as a decoration in the future, I'm sure. But the world is getting... I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to start a new world. It'll be next time, so I don't know when the next video will be. 5,400? That doesn't even seem like that much money. I think it's better just as a decoration. Wait, wait, wait. Can I push a button? Looks like there's a button on the front. I thought maybe I could push the button. No? So do I just sell it? Boop. Alright, whatever. I found the treasure. Yeah, I'm not going to sell it. I don't want to sell it. Not for 5400 is a treasure. I'm going to keep it. So can I go take the other treasures and then like... Have all of them. Because <laughs> technically it's open already. 
if they're still there, I could just, you know, take them, and we'd be good. Do, 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 do. Is it closed? Nope, I can take these. All right. I mean, I don't want the broken sword. I like this, and I like the vase. Oh, my God, my game freaked out. Do, do. I'm excited. So, next, next run. Biggest reason why I'm going to be resetting and just doing a new world. There is an insane amount added. I've talked about it kind of in the past. The building aspects is what I'm most excited about because I enjoy building in games. This game is actually pretty fun to build after you buy all the pieces. The buying part is a little tedious just because you have to buy little pieces. But there's bigger ones now, so it's going to be a lot less pieces to have to buy. And, I mean, if Ark taught me anything, the more pieces you add, the laggier your game gets. So it'll also be less pieces, so the game shouldn't have more, you know, as much issues. But, I mean, this is the alpha version that's not even up into, like, on Steam yet, so. <laughs> it, it, you know, I, I expect stuff like that when I'm playing this. Honestly, this game runs insanely well. Like, insanely well. I, 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 it's impressive. Like, it is truly impressive. Because it's like, one person is making this game. That, to me, is just like, with how well it runs and how well everything works, it, it's, just, it's just extremely impressive. It's not something that I could do. I can definitely say that. Not something that I could do. Uh, but, yeah. So, I'm just going to kind of... I mean, this is like the nicest building we have. I'm going to build a freaking mansion next time. We're going to have to start at the bottom. But we're gonna, I'm going to see how quickly I can get to the point that I just start making an insane amount of money. Because, I mean, we know the system. The best system that I have in this entire place is actually, I feel, almost at back at the beginning. Just because there's so many things, each thing has its own pipe system, so nothing is getting, like, separated, nothing's getting delayed. This system here, however, I feel, I don't know, this one worked really well. We got a lot of big gold from it. There was a lot of power going to each one, so we had a full 100% here. And then, you know, the 50 from there, so that separated the gap here. But, I mean, this is one of the best systems I felt that I had, because it was non-stop big chunks of gold. Only time it stopped was when I could see visually right here something broke down. So I I feel like this was probably one of the better ones of all the things I did. I mean it could have been slightly better if I would have taken the filter filter there and put it here instead. That probably would have been a little bit better because it would have little been a little bit more filtration going into the harvester, which is kind of what we. I don't know why I did that to be honest. I'm looking at it now like I don't understand. But this system was one of the best. Uh, the system back at. The other place was pretty good, but this part right here, I don't think I'll ever do that again. I think if I do this again, I will straight up make a road that goes all the way from here, all the way over to there, and I'll build a, a track or a house, or not a house, but a factory over there. I'll probably still end up using the second place that we were at as uh, pretty much just a place to build a, pla build a house at. I don't know if I'll end up doing anything else with it. But I'm definitely going to be building a house at it. Can I just kind of... I want to rotate you. No! Alright, sleep real quick. Get get the night gone. Make it daytime so we can see. Boop, there we go. I mean, that would have helped too, but whatever. Whatever. Yeah, see, I don't really have the room to store this and make it look all nice. No, stop it. Sit up. I just... I just want to decorate with it. Okay, uh, this way. Boop, right there. Okay, you go in the corner. Go in the corner. If I open the door, will it push it? Come on, work with me here. Not against me. All right, whatever. It's about as nice as I guess I can get it. Because then it's gonna tip over. There we go. Perfect. Perfect. Ah. And I can take this one, put this next to it. Oh crap, don't move. Get a little bit of artifact there. Get the golden chalice. Put that right there. All right, yeah. Now I have a nice little decoration here. <laughs> this system was really good though, honestly, too. The only downside of this was just, uh, I mean, that obviously doesn't work. I need to, I'll have to do something else about this. Because we can't auto smelt, really. I don't know if things will change. It's going to be a lot of experimentation to see what all changes in the update as well. But, I mean, I've destroyed so much of this world at this point. Like, we have so much of this dugout down here 
the I just feel like I, I'm gonna have to be in a new place to get everything, especially with how much is dug up with the main claim, the first claim. And yeah, uh, like I said, I don't think this is gonna be very long. There wasn't much more I really wanted to do, especially with everything being wiped. It kind of just doesn't give me that doesn't give me that urge to continue on in this world. I definitely want to continue on with this game. I mean, I think as of this moment, I was looking at it last night. Uh, I have 52 hours play time in this game. 52 hours I have played this. And I have enjoyed almost all of it. Uh, the only parts I would say that would kind of suck would... It would be awesome if there was, like, the pickaxe. You could just hold the button down and it would keep pickaxing. Because, like, that... My finger today is even, like, sore from the amount of, like, digging I did yesterday. And how much I've done lately. The car definitely helped things. But this was probably my favorite place. Just look-wise. Like, this place was amazing. On, on how everything just looked... It worked well, but the problem was I never felt like I got the big nuggets. Like, we got this size and everything, but it's not, it, it wasn't the super big size, and I don't feel like anything was, like, too out of whack. Oh, God. Oh, God. Maybe maybe my power system wasn't fully connected. You know what? We could actually check real quick. Don't I have a, a gauge somewhere in here? Did I never buy a gauge for this place? I didn't. This will be the one I actually want to check. I'll be right back. I'm going to go quickly get a gauge, because I do want to know like it, what what it was It was making it so this wasn't as well. And I'm wondering if maybe I just miscalculated the amount of, amount of power we need. I'll be right back. So let's put this gauge on real quick. Rotate right there. Oh, I can't really see it. All right, and then just go turn it on and see. Do 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 do. Where are you? Yeah, I can't. No, it looks like it's full. I mean, you can see the the arrow kind of pointing straight over. All right, I'm gonna quickly adjust this real fast. I, I want to be able to actually see it, and I can't quite see it. Cause, I, like I said, I want to take all the knowledge from this time, put it towards the next one. In order to do that, I have to make sure I fully understand what worked and did not work last time. I guess this time, anyways. Okay, put you right there. Yeah, we're almost at like 100%. So I'm not sure what the deal was here. Why it never actually produced the big chunks. Like, it sh I would I would imagine it should have. Uh. Yeah, like the stuff coming out of here is not very good. Can I? There we go. Just want to turn this thing on to see. If I remember right, it wasn't, like, really big ones. Yeah, like, that's the size of, on average that we got. And that being the size on average, like, it just... It's not netting a lot of money? Especially since we get these small ones like that. I don't know if maybe, uh... I was gonna say I was gonna try to dig some myself up real quick, but... I don't have a whole lot. I actually left when I dug this whole thing up. This area right over here. Specifically for that reason. Can you turn on? There we go. Like, I left this one little chunk just so I could have a little bit of dirt. This was the one place that I felt like I wanted, I wanted to figure out, like, why. Because clearly there was something wrong here. I felt, oh my god, I'm stuck on my pipe system. Because it should have been going it should have been going better. Uh, I could just dump it out, I guess. Oh, it's not sorting. No! I don't care. Oh god, that's horrible. I do care. Like, looking at it is painful. So, can I just... Yeah, see, nothing... It's just not that big. Like, we aren't getting the super nuggets. Everything's connected well. I mean, if you look at this, the sizes of the dirt going in there, though, compared to the, I guess... Because we are getting tiny little pieces of dirt that are falling in, that are giving us those big chunks. So, I, I don't know. I guess it is beneficial yeah I don't know I guess maybe this was my favorite system just because of how it worked it constantly flowed and the only thing the only downside was the spanners but with that up, update coming 
it's gonna change things there. Oh god, I need to turn it off before it gets too insane. We're gonna cross a line of the frame rate dropping down to like absolutely terrible. Oh, and the pipes. That's that's another thing that was so nice about this one is the way I had it set up, right here, made it so all of these conveyors were always running. And I don't know what their pressure was. I don't assume it was too bad, but I'm pretty sure their pressure wasn't even that bad. I probably could have increased it a little bit to gotten past this whole little catch here. But I think these things are or like, are slightly bugged right now. I don't know. If, I don't see, and that's what I mean. I don't. I assume there's going to be a lot of bug fixes coming up. Oh my god. I assume there's only going to be a lot of bug fixes coming up and the, you know, optimization and stuff. It's just something that slowly gets worked on over time as the game is being developed. But I do just know that there is a lot of stuff, a lot of stuff coming. A lot of decoration interiors. There's actually a whole new shop being added of interiors. Like, you should check out the dev blogs if you're honestly wondering. Like, I, I it, it's, it's pretty cool. Like, there's... There's so much. I just, I can't even get over how much is coming in, like, one patch. It's crazy. But I guess if, with the game coming out March, or May 8th, uh, yeah. Definitely want, he wants to have it ready. But I think I'm gonna end it here for now. So it's a short video compared to usual, but just because all this is gonna go away, and we're gonna start with the scratch, fresh, new world when that patch comes out. I don't know when. I want to say I heard the 28th. But I could be completely wrong. I've heard so many dates lately with, the, with my kids' school and all this, everything that's going on, that I'm not 100% sure. But uh, it may, it, it may, it's probably going to be about a week, maybe. I wanted to do this today just in case it was, like, tomorrow or tonight or something, you know, like that. Like, I, I didn't want my world to get wiped out and not be able to get to that treasure. So, yeah, thank you so much for watching. And we now know what's inside the treasure room. I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye for now.